Hey, I'm Josh Frame from the Tetsuo in Sydney. We're here in Noosa Head and we're on a mission to find the best Japanese dish in Queensland. We're hitting the benchmark pretty high here at the Two Hay restaurant. Wasabi, let's go and try it. All right, so today we're going to do um, Jack Street strip loin. Uh, we're going to cook it over Japanese charcoal vinchitan. Uh, we're going to serve it with roasted shallots, a little red miso wagyu glaze, some onion rings and a bone marrow. It's, this one's finished in the Darling Downs, which is in Queensland. It's finished on grain for 450 days. I like the strip loin because it's nice and consistent. Uh, good colour. The fat is amazing. It's a great taste. And the boys just know what they're doing. It's a great product. So the bone marrow is uh, coated in uh, red miso glaze with wagyu shu uh, and sashimi and then we just bake it in the oven for about 15 minutes until it's nice and golden and put it back on top of the bincho. Second place, we're at Sumi Open Kitchen. So this guy's been uh, all over Japan, working a lot of farms, and now he's come back to Noosa and opened a new uh, open grill restaurant. So here we are. We're going to be cooking a Black Angus sirloin. It's a product from Kilcoy. It's just on the way to Brisbane. It's what they call ebony. It's been raised on pasture and then finished for 20 days and grain. It's cooked over uh, charcoal, marinated it in uh, rice koji, soy, miso, sake. There's some enzymes in there which um, are going to uh, help break down the proteins. It makes it rather tender. Okay, we've just arrived in Brisbane. We're in uh, Howard Swift Wharf. So now we're going to go to Yoko Dining. They're doing a little thing with uh, intercostal. So we're going to go and check it out. Hey guys, this is Kita from Yoko Dining. Today we're going to cook beef tartar and wagyu beef finger. Grass fed beef tenderloin. So I love to use a tenderloin for the beef tartar. We infuse the kombu first into soy sauce yep. and a little bit of ginger, mirin, sake. A little bit of scallion. And this is a rice cracker, like Japanese rice cracker, called tsubu arare, all mixed together. Some people like more texture meat, and some people like more soft meat. Same as like a grilled meat as well, you know. Olive oil. This is a beef finger. We're using a Queensland one from A and Co. This beef finger is just like between the rib bone, just here. This is wagyu, slow cook overnight, and then we're gonna finish at the bachi grill. After caramelized, we're gonna finish with the pizzeria. Hey. So now we're in Portside in uh, Sena. So now we're gonna have a more traditional style Japanese food. We're in a little private dining room, so it should be fun. Ishiyaki, it's a wagyu, it's a local from Queensland. The Ishiyaki beef cooked on our own stone. The overly steamed will be a for selling shallot and some black beans. So, what marble score is this? Um, this one will be eight. Eight. In the Sukiyaki restaurant. That is so delicious. So good. Yeah. We just uh, arrived in Gold Coast and we're going to go and check out a little uh, tucked away uh, traditional Japanese uh, barbecue called uh, Wagyu Ya. So this is the Wagyu, uh, Wagyu beef tongue. A lot of the texture, a little bit gamey to, to the end, super tasty. Rib finger in Tsukostu, rib, skirt. Chucked up flat. Yeah, it's just nice that you can, you can choose, each different meat has a different texture, so it's nice that you can actually cook it yourself. Some of them are just like sheer fat, some of them are a bit more meaty and a gamey finish. It's a good, good little selection of beets. And this grill is incredible. It's nice to see a lot more secondary cuts on the board, and it's not just premium, because with Wagyu, it's pretty much all premium as it is anyway. Okay, so last stop of the road trip, we're in Mermaid Beach. We're going to check out a little uh, restaurant called uh, Itsu Azakaya. They're doing some Wagyu Gaeza, so it's quite interesting. Mix it up and see what's going on. It's a great venue. We've got uh, some beautiful Wagyu Gaeza, house made, obviously. 
Beef cheek katsu. Super rich. Oh, oh, oh. It's like real gamey. Beef cheese gamey. Beef tataki with truffle, parmesan, fennel. Oh, the truffle really, really pops.